In this demonstration, I'm going to show you how to create value using complementary colors. Complementary colors are simply colors that when placed next to each other, they create the highest level of contrast for those two colors. And when mixed, they cancel each other out, creating a grayscale color like white or black. And value just refers to how light or how dark a color or hue can be. So here I'm finishing my composition again. This particular demonstration is about value and contrasting colors. So the illustration or the composition is going to remain simple. Whenever you're ready to start painting on your main piece, you want to go ahead and start with the background. That is going to give us some room for error. That way, whenever we're making any edges or making any lines, outlines, we are able to go back and paint over it. We're using acrylic, it dries pretty fast, so we will be able to paint over any mistakes that we can make. So that's why it's important for us to start with the background. As you can see, I chose to start my background with a shade of blue. And to make it darker, I went ahead and added a little bit of this complementary color. In this case, it was orange. So I started with the darker edges and then I'm going to go ahead and start going lighter as I go inwards towards the center of my paper. And to do that, all I have to do is just add a little bit of white. And of course, the more white I add to my mixture, the lighter the color is going to become. So I'm going to continue painting my background and this time I chose uh, brown for the bottom part of my composition and in order to make that brown color I'm going to mix complementary colors purple and yellow and to give it the hue or the shade that I want I'm going to go ahead and add a little bit of orange to my mixture and this is the brown that I created again I'm using complementary colors purple and yellow and I added just a little bit of orange to give it the hue that I needed for this part of my background. And again, to add value, to change the tone, all we have to do is add a little bit of white here and there. And that is going to create the illusion of light and give us a little bit more depth. I am pretty close to finish painting my background, but as you can see, I did accidentally go into the outlines of my cake and my table, but I'm not worried at all. I'll be able to fix that. And that's actually one of the reasons why we ask you to start with the background and leave the details for the end. 